everybody and welcome back to another episode of our modded series and I heard you I've changed the battle arena well actually I don't think anybody requested this but I thought personally if we're gonna see all these amazing beautiful mods that people on the community have spent time making and you know programming and just basically putting a lot of love and effort into it why don't I do the same with where we see these guys? So I've developed this Tasmanian terrain uh, environment. So if you didn't know, this is a mod, Tasmanian terrain mod. Would you believe it? Apoplically called, is that the word? Well, we're making up words. Uh, by Jack Mills, who's the author. Now I'm gonna credit authors. Uh, there's a lot of different people who upload. Um, so like people make the designs and then people buy it and then they upload it and I really think it's the people who have made it that probably deserve credit. <laughs> I mean it's uploaded the reason why we have it but also you know if they didn't make it then that wouldn't even be the case. So we have got some amazing dinosaurs to see. These are all made by Jagged Fang Designs. Now from what I know um, these are uh, or this, uh, these sort of mods are bought by other people and then uploaded. So they've just sort of made them themselves, Jagged Fang. And then it's up to the people that have bought them, have decided how to show them and put them in Jurassic World Evolution, in other words. But here is the first one that we're going to have a look at. And it is a beautiful Kiranai Disney and Montosaurus. Look at it. Now, doesn't that look like something you could see out of walking with dinosaurs? Wow. I mean, if we can see it from the trees and the magical zoom outness. Was it? Oh, there, there we go. We'll get there eventually, guys. I'll get it eventually. So, what I've decided to do is actually make a full blown herd of these. We're going to make a natural ecosystem with these guys. Now, there are some. I don't know if there's different skins, but I've given at least two of them. Um, a different skin. Chances are they probably won't, let's be honest. <laughs> but I just thought if we had this herd, um, it would make sense for at least a few of them to look a little bit different. Maybe get that little sexual dimorphism on there, girl, you know what I mean. We can just get a lovely jubbly herd of Edmontosaurus. Oh, yes. See, I was going to say Edmontosaurus. Look at that. Look at the normal maps on that. They just pop. Oh, hold on. We can probably get a better view. Let's let's do this. Let's do this. There you go. Oh, yes. Look at that. Look at the detail on these guys. Oh, it's something I could see out of a dinosaur documentary. It is gorgeous. I'm just wondering how many. <laughs> Look at you. Aren't you just cute? Yes. There's some over here. Now, I don't know if these guys are making their own herd. I'm not so sure. We'll see. I mean, there's loads of them there just walking about. Oh, it's so walking with dinosaurs. Oh, it's just beautiful. Now, I think this one should have a different color. Oh, damn. This is so good. Now, I know there's a lot of people that are um, quite annoyed that, of course, this isn't in consoles. This is only on PC at the moment. Oh, what they should do is actually add a randomized size. So you could have adults and uh, younger ones. That would be good for the modern community to add, seeing as we can't have babies or anything like that. Look at that shot! Oh, just play some more with dinosaurs music. Play it! Damn! There we go! Oh, that's what we do on this channel. That's what we do. Copyright! <laughs> oh, they all seem to be getting on. Look at that! They're having loads of fun. Okay, so that is the Edmontosauruses. I think that's probably all of them. So there's a big group of herd of them. Now, now we've got another one. These, I think, again, are all made by Jagged Fang Designs. We've got the Nigerosaurus there, another one there, and then we've got the Kamarasauruses. So we'll have a look at the uh, Nigerosaurus. Now this looks beautiful. Look at it. Now everything's got a similar kind of color scheme. And he looks so cute. He's got the walk with dinosaurs spikes on the top of him. He looks fantastic. It is. Oh my god, why is got like blowing music playing in my ear and they're so cute it's like a little invasion of the tiny saurs little tiny sauropods this one however yeah that's a camara but look at this oh we got no monosaurus over here look how big the monosaurus is in comparison to the, the nigerosaurus they're so cute but look at this for a shot when you do is blow the background you've got yourself oh wow who needs movies anymore? I just, I think to myself, if I was a kid, 
and I was playing this game. Wow. Just wow. To think of all the low polygon games I've played when I was a kid, I would have killed for something like this. But I wonder if kids these days look at it and go, eh, it's okay. They need to go pack back and play like really bad games. Wow, I love these little guys. They're so cute. Now, how can an Ament and my Mentosaurus and Montosaurus be killed where an Igisaurus can't be? Or can it? I think maybe it can. I think maybe a, uh, a large carnivore can kill it. I think. Look at those spikes. Look at that. Oh, hold on, can we have the intro music? Da, 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 da. <laughs> That's beautiful. Oh, oh, hello. And I love the shots of that. Look at the teeth. Looks kind of like a guppy fish or something. And the spikes as well. It's a stickleback. It's a stickleback fish. I like the little, little hints of spikes on the head. Look at that for detail. Fan, bloody tastic. Now, there's an there's annoying thing with YouTube, right? It doesn't matter how well I put up the quality of a video. In fact, if I make the quality of a video better, it actually blurs it and pixelates it. So, the raw video for this will look beautiful. But on YouTube, it won't look too great, and that's freaking annoying. I, mean, I think the only way I can get past that is to upload at a higher quality, like as in a, a dimension, not 1080. But that means that the, the size of the video is upped by like two, three or two times as much. It's just really not worth it. It's such a shame. So if you do have the chance to use these mods, oh, do, do. Like this video isn't doing it. Look at that. Look at, they all, they all look like they live in the same universe and same area. They are beautiful. Now the sauropods should be, because I think these guys can eat from ground feeders. Look at that eye. It knows all. I think they can. Or we can make it look even bigger by doing like a goldfish, a fish eye. GoPro zoom lens. Wow. It's like I'm really there. Colin Trevorrow, look, I'm in your new 3D game. Is it, oh, wow, wow, he can, he's got a sprint on. Look at him, <laughs> scale that hill. Jesus. <sighs> da, 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 da. I'm thirsty. Now, the sauropods, or at least the Camarasauruses, should be heading over into these trees. Because in these trees is one of their feeders. And this guy's already found it out. He sniffed it through the, all the foliage. Oh, look at this. This is what it's like to be in Jurassic World. Beautiful. And that's the poop hole. They actually added that in? That's amazing. Did they have that in the regular? They wanted a poop hole. <laughs> As we'd call it a putty butt. But how about the plains? This is where the hunts will take place. This is where we are going to release our carnival. Oh god, looking at this guy, he looks very similar to the Mutaborosaurus in Walking with Dinosaurs. So he's the head shape. I can always hear it being killed by the T-Rex. I was like, yeah, yeah, yeah. God, that was brutal. Ooh, ooh, I remember that as a kid. I was like, wow, this just feels wrong. <laughs> we have the killers. Now, these guys will get on because the mod that I've added to the game got an update. So every carnivore or any dinosaur that you can make has the utmost amount of DNA sequences that you can add to it. No matter what era, you can, even in Jurassic era, you can add that they need comfort. You can add that they need the social. This is the one that you guys have been patiently waiting for. 10 minutes in, I think. Here you go, are you ready, guys? Are you ready? Okay, it's from the wrong side, I do apologize. There we go, oh no, maybe not. Jesus, it's hard. Oh, the Yang Chung Osaurus, or Yang Chung Osaurus. I think it's Chinese. But, I mean, it's called an Allosaurus at the moment. But, you know. But look at that model, man. Look at it. It is gorgeous. Oh, he's making his way towards the Edmontosauruses. Now, they should, they should be able to go in a group of four. They should be able to. Now, I don't know whether or not they will all commit murders. This guy looks like he's about to line up. Oh, I love the feet. I love the darkness of that, those feet. Oh, they are. Oh, he's. Who's the alpha? Ah, you're the alpha. Okay, so it's coming over. Now, when it comes to these mods, I, I want to make some more special. And this is exactly that. We could very easily just showcase them in an enclosure and be like, hey, look, there's this thing. But this is just a lot cooler. This way we get to showcase a few of them. And I'm not going to do it for every single one, especially when there's just one. But look, there you go. Look at that. Wow! 
damn! This is something that Frontier could have released. Look at these guys. Oh my god. They haven't even made a kill yet, but damn, they've won me. Yeah, I don't even know if um, Frontier or, sorry, Universal would give the go-ahead for these. Um, just with the design. I, I, you never see, like, a, a, a bright color like that on a dinosaur. Or at least a, a varied, um, very pretty, um, almost bird-like color. Again, these were made by the extremely talented Jagged Fang Designs and uploaded by Paleo Dude 123 I also want to just keep an eye on these guys um, just to see if they do manage to get a kill. Oh, he's squaring up the Camarasaurus. Ooh, ooh, he's going over there. The other three are still here. Now, there should be four in total. Um, I don't think they can take on a Camarasaurus. I'm pretty sure they can't take on a Camarasaurus. So we've got fixed rock textures as well, as you'll notice. Look! Oh, wait, what? We're not having a death yet. Okay, okay, we're not, no deaths. No deaths yet. I, maybe they're not even hungry. Like, look at all of these in the plains. They're just wandering about. Oh, that's cool. You can... Oh, so when I change the skin... So this one... We could have this one as the male. Oh, yes! And these ones are the females. They're all sticking together. Don't know why. You're all by yourself, aren't you? Or we can call you the alpha. You're like a silverback gorilla. You're... And Big Yang's off. Big Yang's off. Over the mountains. Don't know what he's going for. But these... Yeah, everyone's kind of getting on now actually the what might be happening oh that was a beautiful shot what might be happening is that i've turned off dinosaur battles which means that they won't kill each other which is actually again like i said might be what's happening so hold on let me have a look oh oh you know what it is he is the leader as well and he's got the different colored crest wow i wonder if the game deliberately did that so so far they're all sticking together they're in the trees here following the leader but they're not really killing anything oh bless if you got the little ninjasaurus like you know, hide in the trees <laughs> you can have that as a baby to oh oh we got a fight oh because they're overcrowded oh i didn't expect that okay who are you betting on who are you betting on oh no are they okay they just want to roar at each other mm. he's not challenging for alpha status yeah he's running off <laughs> you better run off. Look at that. Look at that. It's a complete different model than the Alice. It's not changed a little bit. It's completely changed. It's made. It's sculpted. It's got its bump maps, normal maps, specular maps, oh, no, color maps. It's got everything. It's got blind maps on the eyes. Look at that. Is that a fong? God knows. The only thing is it can't blink. <gasps> what are you going to do, eh, buddy? The Yang Chungasaurus is not very happy with each other. Ooh, just giving a little bit of roar. Are they actually going to bite each other, though? If they get more annoyed, they might. Oh, look! I bet these guys aren't happy because there's too many of them. <laughs> this is the thing right Frontier. Come on. These are so cool. I would love to have a huge super herd like this, yet apparently, according to the game, he's not happy. Look at these guys. Why are you not hungry? Why are you not attacking these Immortosaurus? You can! You're technically an Allosaurus. You're like the most aggressive and killer thing in the entire game. But I get the feeling you're going to resort to killing each other before you even eat anything else. So even though it's actually the herbivores that are making these guys overcrowded, um, they would rather kill each other than take on the herbivores. So I think some code needs working on here. Look at that. Look at the, the hip bones, the ribs. Oh, damn. That's nice. We got another one walking in here. Any deaths? Any deaths? No deaths. Health is actually dropping because they are so hungry. Why? 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 Oh, okay. So we... Right. It's on normal. If it was on non, dinosaurs will not even hunt. So it's on normal. So they should technically be doing it. It might be a case that there's just like too many of them and they can't pick. They're like little kid in a sweetie shop. They just cannot pick. How is the cuties over here doing? <laughs> Little baby ones. Oh, God. Here we go. Here we go. What's this? We've got one of the Yang Chungasauruses over here. Comfort should be rising now. That population doesn't affect them. Yep, population's fine. Social? <gasps> You're by yourself. You're lonely and brokenhearted. Oh, here we go. Oh, we got it. I didn't even see it. Bam. Taken down. There you go. <laughs> In the lake. Beautiful. 
Oh, they're all gonna flock to this, I think. Unless they decide to eat other ones. Whether they want to make um, kills themselves. Oh, they're coming over. Two of them are. I don't know where the third one is. Oh, there we go. He's made his own kill. The alpha. Oh, he's not the alpha anymore. He's completely lonely. Look at that. He's completely uncomfortable because he ran away. <laughs> Look at them go. No, no, no. And herein lies the problem with Jurassic World Evolution and carnivores. The fact that these guys were in a group and they were happy. And then one of them split off, which would cause it to be uncomfortable. And therefore, it is now able to break out of an enclosure. They shouldn't do that. There should be, just like with JPOG, a minimum and a maximum amount that the carnivores can be within each other's range. Because they wouldn't choose to do that. Uh, or maybe, you know, in some cases, maybe they would get lost. But if it's up to the carnivores' decision, they would not get split up from their pack. And... That's something that JPOG didn't really have a problem with because as soon as a dinosaur went too far out, it would do this and it would just run back. Whether that was because the um, the leader decided to go for a hunt and then it ran off, the other ones would follow suit and they would go, okay, that's our leader, we need to go over there. And for some odd reason, that's not the case with this. It went, even in JPOG, if the leader decided to hunt and was hungry, the other ones would do the same even if they weren't. They would just go along with it. They would go along with the hunt. I mean, the Allosaurus is still over here. Just yelling at the uh, Nigerosauruses, scaring them out of their little brains. He's like, no! Run away, run away, run away! But these models are absolutely gorgeous. Oh, we got another death. Well, I'm assuming it's not you. Oh, there you go, another one. So they must all have got a kill now. Full, full, full and starving to death. So much so he's on 87% health. Now, I'm really, really stuck on whether to choose this skin for the Allosaurus or the Big Al skin. I do love the Walking With Dinosaurs skin though, but this, it's a whole new species and it looks gorgeous. Oh, it's tough. Decisions, decisions. It's always hard, isn't it? But look at that, the arms, everything is different. They've got three claws there. I don't think the arms are rigged or the fingers are rigged at all, which is something that, you know, Frontier would be able to do. Whereas these modders can't because they can't change the rig, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> like in some cases, they probably just don't even rig some of the limbs if they're extra or if they're in a different position. Or if they do rig them, they'll just have them as a solid skin weight. So they just move like completely 100% to whatever the uh, skeleton moves to. But guys, I hope you've enjoyed this video. Something a little bit special, uh, taking you back in time to the Tasmanian jungles. So we've showcased one, two, three, four different mods. We've got the Yangchung, we've got the Kamarasaurus, we've got the Edmontosaurus, and this whole environment with different trees. These are beautiful trees, the tall trees there gorgeous as well as the the environment just sort of blending together you've got the dirt you've got the grassy textures you've got the texture of the um the brush that's that looks a little bit I mean, we zoom out there it's a bit more yellow you've got uh, the rocks as well have been redone uh, and i don't know if any of the rocks have changed no that these are the models from the other mod uh, so the, the other rocks should be the same but the tree this tree in particular is different the red yeah, the red the wet woods <laughs> the wet wood trees also have a retexture to make them darker to fit them with more of the aesthetic and just with this there you go you've got your own movie shot that is absolutely amazing <laughs> i love it even the these palm trees to the left where that young yang chungasaurus is they've been textured differently and colored differently to or I think, well maybe not textured but colored differently just to fit in with the whole tone that this pack has has. With the the um, colors and tones of everything except for the Yang Chungasaurus, everything being different shades of browns, greens, creams, whites, um, except for the Yang Chungasaurus, which um, I suppose you could arguably more related towards. Oh, there you go. There's another kill um, towards birds. They're the ones that seem a little bit more brighter in color and tone, and it just it just works. It just pops. It brings just that extra little bit of diversity into what is kind of a bland, but actually really aesthetically pleasing landscape, including the dinosaurs, because they look gorgeous. But anyway, guys, if you enjoyed this video, leave a like, and until next time, I'll see you later. Oh, bye-bye.